Hello and welcome back to White Lines Football. Lewis here again today with another Match of the Matches. But today we're not going to Gillingham, we're actually going to Wembley Stadium to watch England versus Lithuania. Gareth Southgate's first home game in charge after he got the job on a permanent basis. It should be a good day out, I think. I'm expecting to see a good side. Uh, they played quite well against Germany with 3-4-3. I'm praying that they're going to play that again. I'm really hoping they'll play Ben Gibson. I'm looking forward to seeing the likes of Lallana, uh, see how he's progressed because he was just breaking into the England team last time I saw them play against Peru just before the World Cup in 2014. I'm looking forward to seeing Defoe because he's earned his recall. Yeah, I think it should be a good day out. I'm here with Dad. Hello, Dad. Hiya. Looking forward to... It's going out to Wembley yeah, today? Yeah, good day out. Sun shining. So it is shining. Good. It's really hot. Have you got a prediction for us? So, obviously, oh. Lithu Lithuania are not the strongest of teams. I reckon 3 1 England. You think Lithuania will score, yeah? Yeah, they might get a sneaky goal, I reckon. Alright, fair enough, fair enough. Who are you looking forward to seeing, like players wise? Because obviously, yeah. Rooney, Kane not in the squad. No, uh, nice to see Vardy. I quite like him. Defoe. Uh, the ex city keeper, Hart. Joe he, Hart, yeah. He'd be good like to see. Him. So I'm actually going today because my girlfriend bought me tickets for Christmas, so big thanks to her. But it should be a good game. I'll take you along the journey. We're off to Wembley Stadium. Let's go. Come on, England. Anybody can see that smile. Ah, young in the music. Ah. We have found a McDonald's. We are halfway down the M25, I think. About 22 miles away from Wembley, so I've got to stop for a quick lunch break. That's a no cheese, yeah? Yeah. That's it, mate. Thank you, driver, babe. Thank you. Yes. We found a random place near the McDonald's because the McDonald's was so badly designed. Oh. Good McDonald's, Dad. Yo. Got his milkshake, he's happy. I've eaten mine, our chicken legend. I think we're nearly ready to get going again. So these people down here seem to think they're buses. Uh, pretty sure it's bus lane, mate. Bus lane and oh, what's this sign say? Bus lane and taxi and bikes only. You, sir, are not in a bus. The team sheet is out. Um, it's I think it's four two three one with Ben Gibson not playing. It's Walker at right back, Hart in goal, of course, captain. A Stones and Keane centre backs, Bertrand left back, Deer and Oxford Chamberlain in midfield, and then Sterling, Lalana, and Ali behind the foe. So. Your mate Vardy not playing, Dad. Oh, okay, guys. Trying to find a car park in hours till kick off. No luck at the minute, so hopefully we'll find one soon. Found a place to park. 25 quid to park. But we're near the stadium. Dad's trying to park now. I don't know if you can, don't know if you can see the arch there, but finally found a place. 10 past four. We've got about 50 minutes now. It's good to know we've made it though. Yeah, it's like, it's just like just like Priestfield to me, mate. Program sorted. Oh, it's windy up here. Windy up here. Seats. Good view. Banging. I haven't shown it yet, but we're right, right near the front of the top tier. I say. Uh, I'll swap it around. This is our view of the pitch. Takes a little view, really.
I'm in England. Let's go. All the way then. Good view. Not bad. Oxford Chamberlain is playing deep part with Eric Dyer. Uh, a lot of time for the centre backs on the balls at the minute. Drive into the box now. Throw for England. First real movement of the game. Report. Sterling's looking the most likely, I think, to make anything happen. Carl Walker's just missed the chance by him through. England's just keeping the ball. If you're only looking like they can play a bit, but hopefully, goals come and see. That was rubbish. Good chance for Defoe, played through by Lalana. England's starting to open him out a bit now. Thought see Defoe score, that would have been really good. Lalana's got the ball on the right now. Crossed in, over to Defoe's head, and it's out. England looking more positive now. 1 0 England! Yeah. Jermaine Defoe! Come on! Good cross by Sterling, brilliant work by him. See the replay now, it's put in by Defoe, it's good finish. Come on, I knew he'd score, get in, 1 0, finally. Sterling's down injured, but looking back at that Defoe goal. goal. It was needed, wasn't it, Dad? Yeah. It was needed, wasn't it, that goal? Needed. Now we're going to do 3-1. 3-1, all right. I've gone with 3-0, but England come into it a bit more. Uh, Oxley Chamberlain looking lively. Lalana looking lively. Lee Ali struggling a bit, but I'm sure we'll come into it. Everyone looking good. It's a good, good start by England. I was having some problems with the ankle tape. Uh, Eric Dyer has just stood off the pitch for a bit, putting his on, sorting his out. His tape all over the pitch. Not sure what's going on there, but yeah. <laughs> Jesus. The chance for Lithuania, uh, the ball's headed forward, Joe Hart's come to get it and missed it. John Stone's cleared it off the line. That would have been embarrassing, that would have been one all. No offence Lithuania, but that's a bit of a dodgy goalkeeping error there. Did you see it, Dad? It's alright. They're yeah, not good. <laughs> it's half time. One new England. So it's half time, uh, 1 0 England. Thoughts in the first half? Uh, that was alright, a bit slow, but at least we got a goal. So I suppose what you expect at this level though, isn't it? When the team's going to come and sit back against you. Thoughts on the individual players? Deli Ali struggling a bit, I thought. Yeah, get rid of him and uh, bring on Vardy. <laughs> Dad likes Vardy. John Stones and Michael Keane look very comfortable on the ball. But from my interpretation, Michael Keane looks a lot better than John Stone. Joe Hart not had much to do. The one thing he did have to do, he did wrong. So there we go. Bertrand and Sterling linking up well. Oxford Tramblin has done very well coming from deep. Dyer doing the defensive work very, very well of that midfield pairing. Defoe got it in there when he could, got his goal. Deli Ali struggling. He's the one player that stood out for me. He's not done much. Went down towards the end of the half. Adam Lallana has been good. It's good to see his flair in real life. Uh, I've seen on the telly for Liverpool. And it's been okay. It's been slow build up at times, but England have had their chances. If you only can play, and they've had that chance at the end of the half. Joe Hart mucking that up, but if we get a second goal, we'll kill it off. We should be okay anyway, but I would like another goal. Come on, England. Buzz for the second half. Come on, England. Second half's underway, it's a brilliant chance for Defoe. Bertrand with the ball in, Defoe's just sort of missed it, it's gone under him. But it's a positive start, hoping for a couple more goals at least. <laughs> Lithuania have had a shot, uh, nothing came with that, and then Octay Chambers still had a shot. It was not a bad shot actually, it's done okay in midfield, it's done okay. Playing there for Arsenal, maybe that's his actual position. I think he's done alright, but obviously this is against a real test, but he's done okay. Playing centre midfield with Eric Dyer, he's done well. <laughs> So the foe and Sterling off 
for Vardy and Rashford. I'm assuming Shea will stay the same. Vardy, uh, Vardy's got a fire and Rashford's on the left. He's on the ball now, Rashford's on the left, yeah. It'd be nice to see him play, see what he can do. Not seen him before in real life, so positive changes by Southgate. How do you feel about Vardy coming on then, Dad? Yeah, my man. Do you reckon we'll see him score? Yeah, I reckon it'll be a 2 0 finish now. 2 0, change 2 0. I'm going to stick with 3 0, stick with my original prediction. But I'm hoping to see at least one more goal. 2 0 England, Jamie Vardy! Yeah. Called it! Dad called it, Jamie Vardy! Come on! Need a little finish off, good build up play. Good to see another goal. <laughs> Vardy, you absolute cheeky boy. 77,000 did that. Not bad, not bad. Rashford has done well since coming and Jake's a little bit of pace. He's just been booked for a deliberate handball for trying to punch it when the cross came in, but nothing in it really. I might see some energy come on. I don't know who the third sub's going to be, if there is one, but it's a decent little game going on. Vardy's just gone through again, nearly scored again, Dad. Almost. Went, yes. went through. Uh, Guy did, could have gone down. I think something that happened in Germany when he went down didn't get the foul. Might have played a part. I was watching on the big screen. Yeah, he did get taken out, but he'd already played the ball, so missed a chance. Oh, the strikers on corners again. Oh, oh foul corner. Chamberlain shot straight to the keeper. 84 minutes gone now. No third change, doesn't look like it's going to be one, but. Rashford goes down in the closing stages, could have been a penalty, probably should have been, but it wasn't, but there we go, no penalty given. There we go. Wembley's emptying out now. Two to win for England. I think people are going to say it was boring. People are going to say it was slow. Being here though, it was nice. It looks better here in life than on TV. I'm going to say that. It was a good performance. It's a nice build up. Uh, I was impressed by Michael Keane, Eric Dyer in particular. Oxlade Chamberlain did well in midfield actually as well. I thought Adam Lallana and Raheem Sterling both showed their areas of promise. Lallana got the assist for Vardy's goal as well. That was a brilliant pass. Fullbacks did well. Not much to do. Joe Hart had some little shaky moment. Been nice to see another sub. I was looking forward to seeing Ben Gibson, but never mind. If you ain't your players clapping around now. Not a bad result for them too, they lost to England because England is supposed to be the top of this group. But performed well. England performed well. It's a good result. I'll wrap it up back in the car. So back in the car now, uh, game finished. We've got a pie. Slash so decision chips. It was a good game. Do you enjoy it, Dad? Yeah, it's a good game. Good game. It's a good game. I hope you enjoyed the video, the first one that's not actually Jill's of matches and matches. Please like if you enjoyed, subscribe, comment down below, share, retweet, everything. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye. Bye.